Hello students, welcome back to Brilliant Education Doha Qatar. So in this video session, I wanted to explain a small concept from 11th biology. The chapter called Elimination of Nitrogenous Waste Material, Regulation of Kidney Function. What is the small concept name? RAAS mechanism. What is this RAAS stands for? RAAS, RAS. We can say RAS. What is this RAAS and how can it work on the kidney? Look at here the full form of RAAS. R stands for renin. It is an enzyme name. Renin. First A stands for angiotensin angiotensin second a stands for aldosterone aldosterone and the yes stands for system aldosterone system okay renin angiotensin aldosterol system how this going to work this raas system can turn on when when gfr glomerular filtration rate okay the amount of filtrate is formed by the kidney per minute we call gfr gfr and also blood pressure blood pressure decrease when blood pressure and gfr fall off that time this system can turn on when this situation is happening in our body there are a specific cells are there we known as j g cells J G cells called juxta glomerular cells, which are present in the efferent arteriole. What is the meaning of efferent arteriole? This is Bowman's capsule. We know this is Bowman's capsule. Fine. Now into the Bowman's capsule, there is one artery, arteriole enter, right? So this arteriole we call efferent arteriole. And this is efferent arteriole. Here this is glomerulus. This blood capillaries we call what? Glomerulus. This blood vessel we known as efferent arteriole. This is efferent arteriole. Fine. Now here, this wall of here, exactly here, there is a specific aperture is there. The aperture is called a JGA, Juxta Glomerular Aperture. And this aperture contains a specific cells called a JG cells. JG stands for Juxta, Juxta Glume glomerular cells juxta glomerular cells this juxta glomerular cells secrete a specific enzyme the enzyme is called renin enzyme renin is enzyme so this renin enzyme this renin enzyme is essential to convert a liver protein called angiotensinogen. The protein is, what is the protein name? The protein name is angiotensinogen. This is actually liver protein. This liver protein called angiotensinogen is converted into angiotensin 1. This one is converted into in presence of which enzyme? Renin enzyme. This renin enzyme is essential to convert angiotensin 2, angiotensinogen 2, angio, angiotensin 1. Okay, angiotensin 1. This angiotensin 1 convert into angiotensin 2. Angiotensin 2 is 
powerful vasoconstrictor that mean it works on the smooth muscles of blood vessel to increase blood pressure so this angiotensinogen angiotensin 2 is powerful powerful what vaso constrictor constrictor vaso constrictor mean this can increase this can increase blood pressure increase blood pressure you got my point this angiotensin 2 also performs second function what is the function here this angiotensin 2 also acts on this acts on adrenal cortex adrenal gland cortex now look at here if you closely look at here this is this is kidney so on the top of the kidney there is a gland called adrenal gland so the outer part is called adrenal adrenal cortex adrenal cortex secret a specific hormones called mineralocorticoid glucocorticoid sex corticoid different type of hormones are secreting by adrenal cortex so adrenal cortex so on this adrenal cortex this angiotensin act it stimulate this adrenal cortex to secrete secrete a hormone called aldosterone hormone aldosterone hormone this aldosterone hormone once it release from the adrenal cortex this will be acts on DCT of nephron if you look at the nephron this is the nephron structure this is Bowman's capsule PCT descending limb and loop of Henle ascending limb and this is DCT so this portion is called DCT. This aldosterone hormone, this aldosterone hormone, this aldosterone hormone acts on the DCT, acts on the DCT of nephron. Remember this point. Aldosterone acts on the DCT of nephron. So the DCT, this DCT reabsorb re observe more amount of what tell me more water and more amount of water from the filtrate and also reabsorption of sodium takes place so reabsorption of sodium and reabsorption of water from where dct under the influence of aldosterone hormone and aldosterone also perform excretion of excretion of K plus potassium and phosphate. So, aldosterone is that hormone maintaining the mineral balance and water balance in our body. So, that is the reason why aldosterone is also known as the specific name. This is also called a mineralocorticoid. Mineralocorticoid hormone because this hormone is maintained the water balance in our body mineral balance in our body so what happened our AAS mechanism when GFR and also blood pressure decrease our AAS system turn on juxta glomerular cells are secreting the enzyme called renin enzyme this convert liver protein angiotensinogen to angiotensin 1 that one is convert into angiotensin 2 angiotensin 2 is a powerful vasoconstrictor which can increase what blood pressure so it was low blood pressure after the formation of angiotensin 2 blood pressure is increasing and also this aldosterone is act on the dc2 to, to balance our mineral and also water that's how our as system can regulate the function of kidney this is a one of the important concept neat like comparative purpose 
Thanks for watching. Brilliant Katha, your trusted coaching partner for IIT, JE, NEET, Science and Commerce students with 10 years of excellence in quality training. Brilliant Katha.